Be true to yourself and to others. Steady and kind to your sister and brother. Together we. I'm Kyra French, and I'm your host of Behold Teen Talk Media. And today I'm here with Carson from Woodmont Baptist Church, located in Florence, Alabama. I want to thank you for being here with you today, Carson. Thank you. I'm glad to be here. So, Carson, I ask a couple questions. How do you take care of yourself mentally? Some of the few ways I take care of myself mentally, um, a few of my favorite ways actually, is I like to take, you know, nightly walks, daily walks. Um, I like to read my Bible. I like to, I like to sleep a lot. Sleeping is important. Um, having a positive attitude is also really important. And drinking lots of water, that, that keeps, that keeps your, it keeps you hydrated, which keeps you, you know, at your best performance. And um, yeah, just like getting out and having a great attitude with things. That's a really good answer. Sleeping and drinking water is something that not a lot of people know is really good for their mental health. So another thing, what are your plans when you return home from New Orleans? So when I return home, um, I plan to hang out with my family a lot. And I also have a, a lot of work to do. I have, I'm have i taking a summer class so for next year, so I don't have to take it in my school. I am also probably just going to hang around the house and do some do some house things, house things. Yeah. Well, I'm also leaving back to go to Georgia, and what I plan to do there is focus more on my music career. So, what do you want the campers to remember about you from Excite All Stars? The, what I want, what I what I want them to remember about me is that I'm approachable. I want to talk to people about the Lord. I want them to have a better connection with the Lord. I I want to seem like the fun, cool person that you can just trust. And I just yeah, I just really want to I just want to make friends with everybody and help everybody get along and make sure everybody is in a safe place and feels included. Well, it's a really good thing to make sure you know about how people think about you. So this is a question that a lot of people ask, but not a lot of people give the right answer. So if you could change one thing about the world, what would it be? If I could change one thing about the world, it would probably be um, a lot of a lot of hate. Um, the hate, it's it's horrible. Bullying's horrible. Um, Littering, that's horrible. It gets on my nerves. Littering is one of my, it just, it just kind of sucks, but a lot of hate and a lot of everybody just being at each other and arguing and like online, everybody argues online and it just, it just, it's just a lot. So in simple terms, hate, just everybody hating each other. I would change that. That's a good answer because a lot of people would say things like free money or stuff like that, but it's good that you chose something that would affect the entire world in a positive way. So thank you for being here with me today, and that's your host, Kyra, signing off from Team Talk Media. Thank you. Hey.